Friday Night Flashback is brought to you by your local Tri-State Toyota dealers. Toyota, let's go places. Hello and welcome to NBC10's Friday Night Flashback. I'm NBC10's Vice Sick Emma. You know, we assume for many of today's pros that they've been playing the game almost since the time they could walk. Well, right? How else could they be so good? Well, for Eagles running back Jordan Howard, that wasn't the case. In fact, when Jordan was just a youngster, his parents wanted him to play soccer. And so he did, but for just one year. Then he finally convinced his parents to let him play football. And he starred in his Alabama High School, which led him to the University of Alabama, Birmingham, which then closed its doors for financial reasons during Jordan's time there. So he eventually landed at Indiana before being drafted by the Bears and then, of course, traded to the Eagles. Here's how Jordan talked about the winding road of the NFL. I was in uh, first grade. I wanted to play. And then my parents didn't think I wanted to play or whatever. So I had to play soccer for like a year. I didn't really enjoy it, but I played it. Uh, and then the next year, I told them I wanted to play again. And so they finally let me go out there and play. And then ever since then, I've just been playing, been loving the game. Jordan shares a special bond with his father, who was a good player in, of, in his own right. Dr. Reginald Howard lost his life to a lung cancer condition in his early 50s. Jordan was just 12 at the time, so every game since high school through now, Jordan has worn his T-shirt to honor the memory of the man who helped mold him into the player that he is. And hey, don't forget, every Friday at 11, we've got the best highlights in our game of the week during NBC 10's High School Blitz coverage. You can see it online or on NBC10's.com or mobile app.